and Resurrection. One of the well, that was actually a great show. That was our first kind of big show through the company, and uh, and that was one of the first. That was the largest miniature effect show I had really done to that point. I had never really done anything that big, and uh, and it was it was at a time when every movie was being greenlit that had effects in it. What had happened the summer prior was uh, we had um, Independence Day, and then we had Mission Impossible, and we had Twister. So all of a sudden, Holly was like, oh my God, we gotta make movies that have effects in them. So while we were doing Alien Resurrection, you had Titanic, Volcano, Dante's Peak, Thund uh, was it uh, Starship Troopers, um, there's a couple others now, I can't recall off the top of my head. It was crazy. You had like all, and, and it was one, and Dante's Peak had employed, I don't know, 500 model makers, something outrageous. So it was really hard to find crew, and it was at a time when everybody was so busy that it was like, what are, you know, what are we gonna do? We gotta get this job done, and it's a big show. And I mean, it was an extremely inspiring and exciting show for me because I was a big fan of the franchise. I, of course, everybody you know, loved the first Alien and of course, Aliens and, and Alien 3. And now it's like, okay, now we're getting a chance to do the next installment with Sorority Weaver. And this is like a big Fox picture, a lot of fun. Um, so it was a great show. It was a really hard show. I must have worked on the model side uh, in terms of hands-on work. I was in here, I think it was like every day for two months straight, weekends, not with the whole crew, but. I'd come in on the weekends because we just had so much to do and it was a very short schedule for what we had to do. Um, but it was great. I had a lot of fun. And it was uh, Jean-Pierre Genet I was a big fan of, still am. So it was great to work on a film that he was directing. Um, and uh, the production designer Nigel Phelps was great. Everybody on the show was great. So it was, it was a lot of fun in that respect. Uh, but it was very challenging. It was hard. The budget was tight. You know, it was like anything else. Um, but I, I enjoyed it. It was great. And I was really, really pleased with the work. The finished work, I, I still love the, the picture. And uh, I thought production design. And, and it was a great opportunity for us because we were so heavily involved with the art department, like we tried to do on every show, um, that the visual effects and the miniature effects particularly were very much seated in the production design. So it never felt like, okay, here's the, the, the crew walking down the set of the Betty, and then you cut to the outside. Like, oh, it doesn't even matter. We were very, it was all very, very... Um, integral the design. I was real happy with that. I'm always happy to be flipping channels and see Aliens Resurrection and seeing any of those shots of the Betty. I was very proud of that. I generally am never called in until the very last minute, which is the paint job. And I've, I've gotten, I've been able to do some building, which I'm always happy to do, but I'm, I'm pr uh, primarily a painter and uh, that's fine with me. love being a painter.